sure I am that this day now we are the masters of our fate. That the task which has been set us is not above our strength. That its pangs and toils are not beyond our endurance. As long as we have faith in our cause and uh, an unconquerable willpower, salvation will not be denied us. Well, it's 5 a.m. and we just hit up the Golden Girl, Golden Arches, gotta love that bitch, and we are headed to the Grand Canyon. Reagan with our drink tray. Let's fucking do it. Not enough liquids and carbohydrates this morning. Just not, just not enough. Well, thanks to the ever lovely Daylight Savings slash Arizona participating participating in it or not, we missed the sunrise, which you got up early to see. And the sad reality is that I've never been more excited to see a bathroom over the Grand Canyon, but we're here. Reagan's gonna go see the Grand Canyon for the first time, but we're gonna go pee first. We don't actually know what time of the day it is. This is fat. A very windy and a very cold good morning from the Grand Canyon. I don't even care, I'm talking about my phone or my camera right now. So the power of McDonald's and the store at the rim, I have officially nursed myself back to health and we are getting ready and we are basically jamming out and blasting music at the rim and getting my pack ready and I'm freaking ready to get in that canyon. When Billy Yang said, said if I had to choose to have one standout on day among he all the mundane, that shit slapped and we are ready! Let's go! 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 We are in the freaking Grand Canyon. Starting our run, hopefully we're gonna get the whole thing in and no bad weather moves in. I'm stoked, level, maximum enthusiasm, 1006. Good morning! Yes, this is beautiful. We have descended a long, long way to get here. And we have a long, long, long way to haul ourselves back up, but 100% worth it. And we got beach rings. For years, I have absolutely dreamed of getting to the bottom of the Grand Canyon and seeing the freaking bridge that connects this thing. Like, look at this. This is freaking awesome. We are on our way back up South Cape Kaibab Trail and we are ascending actually pretty quickly, pretty swift. I apparently still have those ultra legs, so. So we have now been hiking uphill for what feels like 317 years. And we either have three miles left to go or seven miles left to go. We are not entirely sure. We took the long route because it's always a little fun to take the little extra route and you never really know what you're getting into. Uh, but how about these views? bringing back some of my favorite masochistic things about ultra running, let me tell you that much. Steady uphill climbing, some traumatic flashbacks to Quest for the Crest. Um, just non-stop, but in the sickest and most twisted way. I love it, man, I love it. I am officially finishing this hike. I've been out of water for about two miles, so I've never been so excited in my life. We did it. We are at 21 miles for the day. 
my legs were trashed in the best way possible and it was absolutely worth it. Reagan, how does it feel to be out of the canyon? This is the most bittersweet moment I've ever experienced in my life. Well, we started to run back to the car and then realized the idea of another 5K might actually kill us. My right butt cheek officially has left the building. We're waiting for a bus now. Fast, that was one of the harder things I've done. And I'm going to eat an entire pizza and then cry myself to 